I'm Tanya Hennessy, and this is what I wear. And I'm Catherine Eisman, host of Paramount Plus's new TV show, Undressed. I'm going to drop into Tanya Hennessy's wardrobe to tell you what her clothes really say about her. I hear you read people's clothes. I do read people's clothes, and this is like a whole book. <laughs> yes, it really is. And I want to read it. And this. That's a and Santa then, costume. Yeah, like, <laughs> it's, it's a pink Santa costume. Ho, ho, ho. <laughs> Hurtful. <laughs> You're a guest. <laughs> so what's interesting, you are wearing something that is at once covered up. Yes. And then completely out there. Yes. And that speaks to you. That is you. You're hidden, but you are so out there. And that contradiction is how you live your whole life. If like, Well, thank you so much. That's <laughs> literally it. <laughs> Obviously, there's so much color here and you love it because it's like escaping into a fantasy. Yes. And you were able, you were able to make a fantasy a reality. I know they look like costumes. They do. But they're you. Correct. What they are is they're actually the manifestation of a whole part of your personality that is extra, that's bigger, that doesn't exist in the normal reality of, that most people live in. Mm. And that is your reality. And then every now and then reality comes in and the black comes in and it kind of bites you. Yes. And it just takes the wind out of your metaphorical sails. Correct. Well, you see, I go between this yeah. and then just like black pants, a shirt that is meant to be black but worn so many times it's grey. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You can't live at this level all the time. Oh, it's no. too exhausting. It is. A lot of performers, they'll have like their costumes and they become that character. And I'm not saying that you don't step into the Tanya, like performance Tanya. Yes. But I think that the character that you step into really is also you. I don't think it is an alter ego. I think it is like... Oh, I step into like my best self. You step into your best self. It's not like your creation. It is your truth. And then you have to just deal with the reality of everything else. I think you're like worryingly bang on. <laughs> It's all good though. Yeah, but like I do think I show up authentically and when I don't dress like this, I feel weird. My advice for you is that when life comes and stings you. Yep, quite regularly. Don't go off and put in your black faded t-shirt sulking outfit. No sulking. Put on something bright and face the 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 the, the tragedies and the, the the challenges of life wearing a rainbow. God damn it. <laughs> you're correct. Because that's when you're strongest. That's when you're most yourself. I mean, this industry is hard. And, and as a creative person, I've, I've been rejected more than I've been accepted. Of course. Every day, I think there's something new that I'm being rejected on, um, whether it be my physical health or my career. And what happens is, is I just sink into black. And you, I'll wear that for weeks. And then when I feel better, I put clothes that are bright on. But I think if I put the bright colors on when I'm having a bad state of mind, maybe I'll be able to get through it quicker. Yeah. When you look in the mirror, you go, that's me. That's me. And you walk out the door and the whole world, doesn't matter, you could be wearing, I mean, literally, I mean, I don't know. Some of this stuff is truly bizarre. But you know, like, <laughs> Yeah, that is really bizarre, that one. You know what it is? But I love it. It's your superhero. It's like basically, okay, but this is you as a superhero. You're really good at your job and it's such a special gift to have, you know what I mean? Like, and, and you use it and honour it so well. And I, ne to be honest with you, I never thought someone could be red with their clothes. We've changed my thoughts on this and I'm so excited to watch your show. You're a, you're a really special soul. Thank you so much for doing this. Like, Thank you. Can I live at your house? Can I live at your house? In fact, yes. I am to <laughs> stay. Thank you. Thank you, Tanya. Thank you. So good. <laughs> I'm going to go cry for a little bit <laughs> and then have a muffin. <laughs> as long as they're blueberry. I don't want to see any blackberry. Oh yeah, because positive. Okay, stay away from the black. <laughs>